Well, here we are, we're around at the front of the trailer where all the action is. So one of the big things you'll notice on the front is the ISI2 Extreme 4x4 bike rack holder. Now this is a um, fantastic bit of kit if you do like to take your uh, mountain bikes and bikes away with you to hit the off-road trails. Um, fantastic, well built and you can see just by the strength of the system, really well welded on a super gal uh, steel pipe in the middle here and that's mounted onto your drawbar. So if, if this is an optional extra, so you can mount it onto the trailer and easily retrofit it. But if you know you are going away and you're not taking the bikes, it's as simple as removing these six bolts and the whole unit removes, which will give you much easier access to your front boot. Although while you are away and you want to get into your front boot, it is as simple as releasing the pin and then tilting this forward and you still get access into your front boot. So you've got easy access to for your chair storage, uh, tables, those things like that. Also up the top here is your firewood rack as well. With the firewood rack, this is something that AOR have been doing on their trailers for a number of years now, and you can actually put anywhere up to around 100 pounds of firewood sitting up the top, so while you're traveling, wedging that in here, and that'll give you uh, plenty of extra firewood for the trails, those cold nights when you're out camping. When it comes to wheels and tires, making sure that we had maximum clearance and capability was really important when designing the Sierra. So all the Sierras will come with a 17 inch by eight inch steel wheel, as well as a 285 70 17 mud terrain tire. So a 33 inch tire, giving you plenty of clearance and height off the ground. So when you're hitting those trails, wherever your vehicle's going, you know the Sierra is gonna follow with you. So more with the nitty gritty down the front here. As you can see down on the drawbar, we've got the two Andersons that we spoke about. Firstly, your red solar input. So that's for your unregulated solar blankets. So you plug the solar straight in and that gets regulated through the Manager 30 system by Red Arc. The second Anderson here is your gray Anderson. Now that is switched and your 50 amp output, or you can add a regulated panel into that section to double your solar input if you want to add more solar while you're out camping. You've got your removable jockey wheel with a quick release. Nice big sturdy jockey wheel there to hold the trailer up. And it's all held onto the back of your vehicle by the Cruise Master DO35 hitch. Now that is a fully articulating off-road hitch. So it will rotate forwards and backwards. And with a nice little quick release, locks it all into place. And your two and a half ton chains on each side, holding the trailer to the back of your vehicle. So Shane's gonna back up now onto the hitch. And we'll just let, the, let this down. You can see it's a pretty easy process. We'll just push that button to lock it into place, fairly straightforward. And then we'll get rid of this choppy wheel. Quick release hitch makes it very simple. Undo that a couple of turns, turn that over and the wheel just comes out. Store that away. Do that in reverse. Yeah, these straight forwards. And we'll connect the Anderson plug to the car. That's the Anderson plug, so that's your car's charge wire back to the van, so that's going to charge your uh, batteries. And then we'll connect the 12-pin uh, plug. Just like that, make sure that that locks into place. And then we'll go to the chains. We're going to cross the cha our chains over. Making sure that we just back that off a little bit so we can get it undone later on. Take 
go on the chain. Like that. And as quick as that, we're all hooked up. Put our cover back over there, keep the dust out. Better release the handbrake and... So we're all hooked up to the car. Everything else is locked and packed away. Last things you want to do just before you head off, double tap your red vision power button to make sure all the lights are off. Power's off. Door down. 